Hi, and welcome to Interactive Tutorial. In this video, I am going to show you how to create a trivia quiz. Trivia is one of the most common types of game mechanics. Users can check their knowledge, for example, do you know geography well? First of all, sign into your profile on interactive.me to start. To create a quiz, click the Template Gallery button at the top of the screen. Select Trivia Quiz. You will see different templates. The Preview button will allow you to preview the template. We're gonna choose Start from Scratch option to show you the whole process from the start. Let's click Edit. The editor allows you to officially set up your quiz settings. Click Edit to get started. You will see a start screen page. On the right side of your screen, there is a preview. If you don't need a start screen, you can turn it off by checking this box. In our project, we're about to leave it. Let's name our quiz as Test your geography knowledge. In the description field, you can add a short information about your quiz. It might be How good is your geography general knowledge, for example. You can also change the button text and add an image disclaimer, if needed. Finally, click the Change button in the Cover Image section to add an image. There are two ways to upload a new image, directly from your computer or using the Unsplash library. My library section means images you previously used in other projects. They can be downloaded from Unsplash or from your computer. To add an image from your device, click Upload Media. Unsplash library is direct access to the Unsplash stock photo service. We're going to use this option. Let's enter a subject into the search. In our case, it will be, let's say, travel. Select the image you like. I love this one, for example. Check this box and click place image. It's done. For the next step, go to the question section. We're going to create four questions in our quiz. Let's add some questions by clicking this button. Now we get question 2, question 3, and question 4. Let's start with question 1. Fill in the field question text. Our question will be what is Earth, largest continent. You can also add an image to your question by clicking Change. I'm going to use Unsplash library again. Write Earth in the search field. This one fits pretty well. I check this box and click Place Image. OK, good. Now we go to the field Answer 1. This will be our first answer. So we know that Earth's largest continent is Asia. But we want to create more wrong options to make our quiz a little bit harder. So the first answer will be Australia. Of course, this is wrong answer. Let's jump to answer number 2. The next one will be Asia, which is correct. That's why we mark this question as correct by checking this box. As I said before, we want to make our quiz a little bit harder. So let's make more answers to give the users a harder choice. To do this, click Add Answer button. We're gonna make two more answers. 
The third answer will be Africa and fourth one South America. In the description field, you can write the text that will appear on the screen if the answer was selected. So we have four answers and only one is correct. Perfect. Let's jump to the question number two. Our question will be, what is the capital of Nepal? We're gonna add two more answers again. And start. Kuala Lumpur, New Delhi, New York, Kathmandu. So we know that correct answer is Kathmandu. That's why we mark this answer as correct. Make sure you have only one correct answer. In some quizzes, it might be more than one correct answers, but not in this one. Now let's upload an image to this question. We click Upload, choose Unsplash Library, and search for Nepal. Let's pick this one. We're done with question number two. Let's move to the third one. I want to make a third question, a little bit different. This time our answer will appear as images, not text. We choose images option and now we can upload images. So our question will be, which one is Australia? Let's upload a picture to our first answer. To do this, click Change. This time, we're going to upload an image from our computer. I prepared pictures in advance. Let's click Upload Media and pick the first picture. Perfect! Now we can see our picture as an answer. Move to the second answer and click Change again. Upload the second picture. We're about to make four answers again, so let's add two more answers. Click Change. Upload media, add picture. Same with the last question. Okay, now we have all pictures here. And picture of Australia is located in answer number one. That's why we mark this answer as correct. Finally, let's move to the last question. What is the smallest country in the world? Let's add an image. I'm going to use Unsplash library again. Let's go with Geography. I love this one. I think it fits perfect. We add two more answers, as always. So, Brazil, Singapore, Vatican, Nauru. Correct answer is Vatican, so let's mark it as correct. And now we're done with question section. Finally, we can go to the results section. Fill the header field and give a short description. 
it could be a reward for effort or a comfort in speech. Result number 1 will be shown in case user will give 0 or 1 correct answer. This is not the best result for sure. Let's fill header with Let's try again. And description field with Not bad, but you can do better. We can also attach an image to this result by clicking the change button. Since this is not the best result, we go with set. Okay, this one. Result number 2 will be shown if user give 2 or 3 right answers. It's not bad at all. We fill header with good and description with you know geography pretty well. Click change to add an image. I'm gonna go with geography again. Choose this one. Okay. Let's add one more result. This result will be shown if user done with all four questions correct. This is amazing result and we're gonna fill header with perfect. And description will be are you geography teacher? Let's upload last image. I'm gonna go with astonishment. And since we are very surprised by such a good user result, let's pick this image. Our quiz is ready. Let's click save. Now you can change the color theme of your project if you want. To do this, select the main page of your project. You will see color theme setting on the right side of your screen. Click on the color box and choose the one you like. Finally, click the preview and evaluate the current state of your project. Try your quiz and don't forget to rate how it looks on different devices. To do this, switch between the phone and personal computer icons. If you notice an error or decided to fix anything, return to the editor by selecting this menu item. Don't forget to select a title for your project. This will make it easier to find it. Let's name our quiz as Geography Test. After that, you can safely click the Publish button. Your project is ready. You can share with your friends by sending a link or choosing any other convenient way. Let's view our project. As you can see, our project works perfect. Keep in mind that you can always return to editing your template again by clicking the Edit button in My Projects tab. You can also check statistics by clicking this button. Good luck!